What's going on guys, Luke here again, welcome back to another Transformers Forge to Fight video. So, in this video, what are we going to be doing? Today, we're going to be opening around 500 crystals. Now, uh, I'm not going to be opening every crystal I have, I am going to be opening a lot, but some of them I want to save, um, including the uh, the 5 stars, because, uh, well, hopefully if I get a uh, some 4 star bots in this video, then I will be able to get enough four, uh, five star shards to uh, open two five stars so yeah so uh, yeah let's just go from left to right and we'll just uh, we'll just start opening the stuff that we've got obviously we've got an awakening program we've got the boost crystals now as weird as it sounds one thing that I am lacking that I need a lot of tier 2 basic um, and now I know all oh, those five star signature crystals I've got 13 of these let's get these open there we go. Let's open the last three. Perfect. Um, so yeah, obviously, like I said, we need to um, get some tier two basic. So we've got a consumption crystal here. Duplicate two star. We've got some cyber B crystals. We've got five of these. Five dupes. One three star as well. Loyalty crystal. Can we get a four star ultra Magnus? We cannot. Waspinator crystal. I think these were all from the Beast War event. Three star Galvatron. Four star signature program. There we go. Signature crystals. Let's get these open as well. Superior signature crystals. Let's get these open as well. There we go. Ra five rank up crystals. Hey, we got a tier two basic. Uh, those all crystals I'll save. Should I save them or should I open them? Let's open them. I did want to save them, but at the same time, I want to open them. Right, so we got, what, 244 of these. I know someone, again, in the comments asked me to uh, do a big opening for these. And uh, we'll have to see how many we get by next week. But, yeah, as of right now, I need the gold. I need the resources. So I'm going to open them all now. It just saves me grinding the daily events. Or the daily missions, even. So yeah, we got 134 of these left. Come on. 100 remaining. Obviously, I'll check everything at the end, see what I got. 64 remaining. 54. Come on. 24, 14. Let's open these last four. Right, let's see what we got. Four tier two alphas, that's very nice. But other than that, we didn't really get that much. Not as much as I would have liked. Four star awakening program. Tech. Do I have any tech four stars that I can awaken? I don't think I do. All right, so we're not going to do the premium just yet. We'll do the two stars. Uh, I'll say, I'll do these as well. And then we'll do the tier two class. Let's open these as well, Matt, as well. Then we have the 500 tier 2 essence. Hey, we actually formed a scout. 15 gold crystals. 40k there. Followed by 50k. 123 arena crystals. Let's get all these open. See how much energy on we can get. Because I used a lot on the, um, the en full energy refills. For the, uh, the rebel raptor event. 43 remaining, 33, 23, 13, and 3. 68 energy on 200k gold, not too bad. Four alliance crystals, let's open these. There we go. The elite daily crystals I'm saving for a video. Um, I'm not that bothered about the mod crystals. So I think we're just going to do the premiums now. So let's do the premiums. Uh, we got some free stars. We might as well do the free stars while we're here as well. But it's the four stars that we need. Right, so now we've got... 10 premiums to spam open here. No four stars again. Um... 
Right, so we can do three, three stars. Let's see what we get from here. Three dupes, that's good. Now we can do one four star, and this should be more than enough. What do we get? Ironhide. There we go. So now we have enough to open two five stars for a video. Perfect. So if we go back into here, let's go and do a raid. Oh, actually, no, let's do some arena. Wait, I don't even. Did I even see what I got in the last arena? Finished arenas. Where did I finish? Three to five percent. Three eleven. So what did top one hundred finish on? Oh, it's not even going to tell me. Because I wasn't even playing this uh, this arena that like hard. I was just playing for like playing for fun. I only did like two or three runs as well. I think I stopped after I got the uh all the milestones but yeah maybe after this fight i'll take a look at the rewards and see what the difference is between three to five percent and one to two percent because i could definitely get the top two percent easy if i really wanted to yeah it'd probably only take me one more full full arena run but yeah we got this fight here on auto because i always auto fight up until like tier three and then if it's an arena that I'm actually going for, then I will, I'll take over from there. If not, I'll just keep auto playing until I win and just sandbag. And um, by sandbag, what I mean is put two powerful characters in, and then put one weak character in, so that the matchups overall are easier. So that I'm going to get two wins at tier three, as opposed to just losing. If you guys would be interested in seeing a video on that, the way I play the arena, then be sure to let me know. But yeah, this fight here with Megatronus should be very, very easy. Should probably only take like maybe one, two heavy attacks if the AI decides to do that. Okay, he's already down to 67%. Special one, hit for 1.4k. Come on, Megatron. That's what's taking you so long. There we go. Finally. Took his time. And we got the final fight now. But yeah, one run got me about 800k points. That was every fight on auto. But what I'm thinking of doing, maybe, if you guys would be interested, would you guys want to see me play one full arena? Like one full rotation. So start from the bottom of my roster, move all the way up and record it all for you guys maybe you can see how i play the arena if it's something you'd be interested in it'd be a long video it'd be about 45 minutes maybe even a bit longer depending on how quick the fights were but obviously i'd play every single fight myself and uh, yeah i'll be able to hold the streak a little bit longer because right now my streak's not that high my highest streak is probably about 20 fights maybe but we'll just have to uh yeah i just want to go back to the arena and i want to check the the details for the rewards right so wait really is that how stingy they're being rank 1 to 30 gets you 300 chips right so i got 225 wow so for an extra 15 chips 15 beast war chips to get to the extra the next bracket up what is the point in that absolute joke you get more from the milestones, don't you? How many do you get from the milestones? 10, 20, 34, 44, 50. Uh, yeah, you get a lot. I'm not even going to try and add that all up. Um, but yeah, that, that's a bit of a joke. That The rewards, they're so stingy with the rewards. Like, bring back the Nemesis Prime Arena. If you know, you know. The Nemesis Prime Arena was so good. I think like the top, um, the top like one to two percent, you got like ten Nemesis Prime crystals, and if you finished high, you got the uh, the five star, the five star ones. It was so good, so so good. But anyway, without further ado, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to drop the video a like. I'll have a lot more videos coming out very very soon. So yeah, I've got like, if you haven't already seen it, I've uh, done all of the uh, the Beast War stuff. 
Um, so yeah, make sure you stick around for that. But thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.